Yo, yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So, um, in this video, I want to talk about why tricks and simps get women. Okay, and I, you know, I was thinking about doing this video because I saw some comments under my video I did earlier where the video was called How to Get Women to Choose You Over Other Men. And basically, in that video, I was saying that you know, if you're that masculine type of dude, you're going to stand out from the other guys and that's going to make a woman want to choose you more. Right. So uh, my dude, Johnny Quest, he said, that's all good and well. But what happens when the opposite is true, where the Sims tricks and cornballs are getting the chicks while the dudes who are acting masculine and different are getting rejected? Uh, then my dude, age of Bo Goyo, or thing, I think that's how you say it. <laughs> Boy Goyo, or whatever. He writes, um, that's the norm. Chicks don't give a shit about your masculinity if the tricks give her more value. Check any fancy slash high status bar slash clubs, restaurants in any town city, and you will find all the, the hot chicks there 24 cent seven hunting for rich simps. All right, so let me let me address this now. What you have to understand is this: is that tricks and simps, they're gonna get girls, right? But what you have to understand is is that there's a different type of energy those girls give them. So the girls that they're getting, right? A lot of times they're not getting the same type of women that masculine men are getting. You understand? So what happens is, is that a simp, he'll get a chick and, you know, a simp basically is a dude who bends over backwards, uh, you know, to, for women. You understand? He's like basically kissing ass and, you know, doing a whole bunch of extra shit to get girls. So a simp will get a chick because usually chicks will use simps because they want to use the guy for his attention. You understand? So they get a lot of attention whores. They get a lot of women who string them along. You understand? So the thing is, is that these women out here, they all want a masculine dude because the masculine dude is the most attractive, right? But what happens is, is women will settle for simps and tricks because of what the simps and tricks provide for them. So the simp generally will provide the attention. The trick will provide the money. So the trick is the guy who's using money to try to get girls. You understand? So what a lot of dudes don't understand is that sometimes these simps, they'll get with chicks. They'll go on dates with these girls. Um, but there's a lot of times where they're not even getting sex from these women. Same thing for the tricks. You understand? Unless a trick is, um, you know, shelling out money strictly for sex. You understand? Like he's basically, you know, buying prostitutes or whatever. Unless he's doing that, you know what I'm saying? There's times where those tricks are also not getting sex, right? Now, there are times when the simps and the tricks get sex from these women, but the type of sex that they're getting is what I like to call pity sex. So this means that the chick, if she's, you know, hanging around the dude for an extended period of time, you know, she sort of throws him a little pussy, but it's, it's not really... Um, her best like performance i should say <laughs> so what i mean is the chick will do him because she feels like she has to at a certain point you understand now there's a difference between getting sex from a chick who wants to have sex with you and a chick who has to have sex with you all right i'm gonna say it again there's a difference between Getting a chick who wants to have sex with you and a chick who has to have sex with you. You understand? And what I'm telling you guys, I know some of you guys out there are like, oh, but, you know, I'm not having sex at all. So I'll take anything. You know, I, I don't give a fuck. You understand what I'm saying? And that's 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 that thirsty behavior. But anyway, I have to do a whole nother video on that. But the thing is. I'm telling you guys, you do not want to have sex with a chick who's having sex because she feels she has to have sex with you because it's going to be the worst sex ever in most cases. But again, some dudes ain't getting nothing popping off. So they're like, I'll take what I can get. 
But basically, what you have to understand is this, is that the Simpson tricks, they're going to get chicks, but you have to understand what they're getting. And see, what you have to understand is because, you know, um, um, age of boy Goyo, I know I'm fucking up your, your, uh, your screen name, my fault, but he said, um, he said, chicks don't give a shit about your masculinity if the tricks give her more value. And see, the tricks are not giving the women more value. You have to see, you guys gotta understand something. The, the most value a woman can get is from a masculine dude. You understand? Because he is the height of what a woman is attracted to, what a woman wants. See, the the, the tricks and the simps are just there to occupy them while they're waiting for a masculine dude to show up. You understand? It's like this. Let Let me flip this around. The type of woman that most guys want is a feminine woman like a woman who's real feminine a woman who's you know like like polite soft-spoken submissive sexy as fuck you want that type of chick i'm sure you don't want a chick who's a loud mouth a chick who's not that physically attractive or physically fit or whatever it is um you know a chick who you know is uncooperative i'm sure you don't want that type of chick you see what i'm saying so the thing is, if I'm talking to a whole bunch of women and I'm trying to, you know, teach them some game and the women are saying to me, hey, you know what? I want a guy who's going to be my boyfriend. I want a guy that's going to stick around. So what I would say to them is, oh, guess what? You know, the way that you're going to get guys to choose you over these other women is you have to be extremely feminine because that's going to make you the most attractive to men in general right and then that's like someone saying you know some of these ladies saying well you know these other women out here who are acting like bitches and who are you know uh uh uncooperative are still getting guys so what about when you know guys are, are seeing those girls too and i would say well yeah guys will still have sex with those girls but they're not going to stay with those girls why? Because those girls are not the top tier type of chicks. You understand? So the same thing happens in the reverse when we're talking about masculinity and you standing out as a man. Is that if you're a simp or a trick, yeah, you would get some chicks that's going to, you know, fuck with you and pay you attention. But understand that they're settling for you. They're not with you because they want to be with you. They're with you because you're there right now. You're entertaining them with your attention and your money. But they don't really respect you or really like you like that. You understand? So, so you know, if you want to be a simple, you want to be a trick, that's your business. But understand that that's the type of energy you're going to get from these women. Right? You're never going to get the type of, you know, energy... And the, the same level of respect as a guy who she's actually attracted to. You see what I'm saying? So that's that's pretty much it. That's all I wanted to you know get across. Um, listen, uh, remember, guys, I am going to be speaking live July 18th, 2018 at the Great Love Debate. Click the link below to get your tickets today. Come through and see your boy. All right, so that's pretty much it. I'm out of here, guys. And remember, the truth is inside you. Peace, I'm gone. Now, before you turn off this video, I want you to do three quick things. One, I want you to click the link below to send me a question. If you have a question on dating and relationships, I'll make a video about it. Two, I want you to click the link under that to get my free audio program, Undeniable Game, which teaches you seven easy to follow tips on how to really attract beautiful women. And three, I want you to click the link under that one to go to Bad Boy Membership, where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. What's up? It's dating and life coach, Mr. Locario. Go to Bad Boy Membership com and master the dating game by joining my bad boy membership program in this program you'll receive 45 through 90 minute easy to follow step-by-step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract 
date and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy Membership today by going to badboymembership.com. That's badboymembership.com.